information on a group of criminals that has been terrorizing convenience store owners with ATM smash and grabs. Today, a multi-county raid rounded up many of the men authorities say were behind it. News Channel 5's Homa Bash with new details. Homa, what have you learned tonight? Well, this 46-page indictment, Lee, gives us a lot of insight into those smash and grabs we have been telling you about for years. How they did it and how they got away with it for so long. You've seen it over and over again. Crooks back a big stolen truck or van into a gas station, tear through walls and shatter glass, and in seconds, take off with the ATM. Somebody in a white van just backed right through BP's uh, front door. Now watch closely and you'll see the same thing investigators from five different Northeast Ohio counties saw. These are all the same guys. And they're very bold. They're driving a... a couple ton vehicle through the front of the store. Who knows who might walk out? A 46 page indictment unsealed today reveals details of a sophisticated crime syndicate that stretched from February 9th, 2011 to August 8th of this year. 11 men charged for their roles in smash and grab ATM thefts in Cuyahoga, Summit, Stark, Lake, and Lorain counties. 10 locations in total, including this Rite Aid in Cleveland, where a shiny new ATM now sits, surrounded by posts. Authorities arrested five of the men this morning during a raid on Pratt Avenue on Cleveland's east side and rounded up others throughout the day. But this may have been the tipping point. Two were arrested in this case out of Strongsville just last week, the last time authorities say the crooks hit. In the indictment, prosecutors say the men even customized their stolen cargo vans to fit the ATMs, then took the money machines to a safe house and used blow torches to pry off the doors. The result? Hundreds of thousands of dollars stolen and thousands more in damages. Now, police and the prosecutor's office are holding a press conference tomorrow to release even more details. Of course, we'll bring that to you as soon as we have it. Live in Cleveland, Homa Bash, News Channel 5.